What was the irreparable damage, really, that between Friday and Tuesday, that Parliament would reconvene after going, uh, taking that break? Reason why you, I mean, your leadership went on this path of having the Supreme Court stay the Speaker's ruling on these four seats until the final determination of the case? Well, um, Alfred, let me say a very good morning to you once again and to your cherished viewers. Um, I am very much surprised about the commentary from um, my senior colleague, uh, Pebu. Clearly, he has not been following the matters in court because if he has been following keenly um, the matters in court, um, some of these comments um, would clearly, in his estimation, would be unwarranted. Um, why do I say so? Um, on the day that the Speaker of Parliament was given the ruling, he gave an account as to why he has refused service. This confirms why it is not necessarily about what happens from now till Tuesday. The Speaker of Parliament, because of the anticipation that the majority caucus in Parliament, led by Honorable Fenio Market, because of that anticipation, had already attempted a number of service on the Speaker of Parliament. Unfortunately, unfortunately, the Speaker of Parliament in his ruling agreed that indeed there has been an attempted service on him. But he explained and why, is it not? I'm sure we, we, we all, we all on, did I'm listen to him. Hold on, I'm coming, I'm building mm -hmm. a point. Alfred, hold on for me. But because in his estimation and according to him, a conclave that he had with the Chief Justice, service on members of Parliament and the Speaker of Parliament by virtue of our privileges and immunities, cannot be served on any other day apart from Monday. Apart from Monday, emphasis mine, apart from Monday. And for that matter, the Speaker of Parliament had refused service. Now, my point is, when it comes to service, the CI 47 that regulates service of a process, according to other seven, when it comes to personal service, you need to direct the personal service, but if the person frustrates the service, you put it as near as possible to the person, which was done at the legal department. Now, the question is, what is the CI-47? The CI-47 is a subsidiary legislation, and it was put together by a rules of court committee as per Article 157 of the 1992 Constitution. Now, if you have your Constitution, you may turn to Article 157 of the 1992 Constitution. I am trying to bring to your notice how the Speaker of Parliament unilaterally amended the 157 of the 1992 Constitution without recourse to the procedure in amending a subsidiary legislation as per the 1992 Constitution. Now, the 1992 Constitution that is Article 157, talks about the fact that there shall be a rules of committee which shall consist of the Chief Justice who shall be the chairman. Six other members of the Judicial Council, other than, other than the Chief Justice, mm -hmm. nominated by the Judicial Council, and two lawyers. So if you come to the 1572, it talks about the fact that the rules of committee shall, by a constitutional instrument, shall, by a constitutional instrument, make rules and regulations for regulating the practice and procedure of all courts in Ghana. So it is the sole responsibility of the rules of court committee to put together the CI-47, which is already in existence, that regulates the procedure in court. And in that CI-47, order 7 regulates how service will have to be done. Nowhere in the CI-47 can be seen that members of parliament will have to be served only on Mondays. It does not lie in the mouth of the Speaker of Parliament alone to say 
that there was a supposed conflict between himself and the Chief Justice, and for that matter, members of Parliament and the Speaker of Parliament, can only be said only on Mondays. It does not lie in his mouth. Now, if you come so, to, so, 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 can I ask you that question? No, no, no. So you, you made a point. Let, let, uh, let no, me just so, add this one. So, so that you don't, no, no, no it, it, it's okay. I would have you proceed. But because you made a point about the Speaker refusing service, when he was delivering his ruling, I recall that Alexander Peño Markin made reference to what you are talking about, that he tried serving him and the Speaker's team, the legal department of Parliament, then indicated that the Speaker had given express instructions that he should be consulted before any suit or service is accepted by the legal team. That's correct. Is is it not? That's number one. That, that the, is the, illegal. So, the so Speaker of he, Parliament alone cannot seek to amend Article 11 and that, that is what that, I was that, going that, to point I, I, to. That's, that's, what, that's, that's what I was. I was just leading to a question. That, that, it, that it was not. That, it was not. It was not the Speaker. He indicated that this was after the conclave, as you have made reference to, with the Chief Justice. And I'm saying that. And so you're, it is not the sole decision of the speaker. Please, please, don't do that. Don't do that. Lawyer Pegu is there. He's a lawyer. He knows articles, Article 11. Uh, but did the chief justice the agree or not? No, hold on. No, no I, I'm just hold saying on. that if you say the speaker alone, that's what I wanted to let you know. <laughs> that the speaker was, and I that know you were okay. in parliament. That is okay. But I'm and just then, saying that that was his allegation. Listen, that was his allegation. Uh -huh. That was speaker of parliament's allegation. That there was a conflict between him and the chief justice. But if you read the judgment, from the Supreme Court, as far as the ex parte um, application was concerned, the Chief Justice and the other four members indicated in the um, ruling that they have taken notice of the Speaker of Parliament's allegation that members of Parliament will have to be served on Mondays. But I just read the Rules of Court Committee as per Article 157 to you, that it does not lie within the mouth of the Speaker of Parliament, neither the Chief Justice or a supposed conclave between the two to amend the CR 47, which is the subsidiary legislation. So if you come to Article 11, the source of law, that talks about the sequence of importance as far as our laws of this country is concerned. The Constitution, which is the supreme law of the land, followed by the Act of Parliament and subsidiary legislation and what have you. The 11 7 talks about how a subsidiary, a subsidiary legislation like the CF 47 can be amended. Now, 11 7 talks about the fact that any other rule or regulation, this is Article 11 7, any other rule or regulation made by a person or authority under a power conferred by this constitution or any other law shall be laid before parliament this is the procedure in amending the cr 47 the speaker of parliament could not have usurped any power or a certain conclave between himself and the chief justice per his own allegation to have amended service that is order seven of the constitution and say that members of parliament shall only be served on mondays it does not lie in his mouth and that is why the agency as we took to court yesterday lies because the agency is that we cannot even serve him on friday mr Pegu, we could not have even served him on friday because the speaker of parliament has made it clear that no. of when you don't deserve. find him, you Honest. go to court for an order. So mm -hmm. when you don't find the person, you file what we call application for substance service. What are you talking about? Ah, please, I said for please, ah. please, please. Ah. You I see, see? I, I am saying that. You listen, you listen, I am saying that. Ah, but I said for me, I taught you, you, you law. You are not going to reach me. Oh, no, no. I said for me, I said for me. You, you are my student. You are not going to reach me. Hey, oh, if I was that bad, I'm not sure you'd have passed. You are not telling me that I don't understand. I am not saying you're not bad. Of course, I recognize the fact that you talk to me you. Now you're saying that I'm listening. I am proud of that. I am proud of that. But my point is that I did not say you do not know the law. I said that you did not follow the sequence in parliament. I followed. Listen, I said, let me tell you. If you had followed the sequence in parliament, you would have known that even substitute service 
in this particular instance uh -huh. wouldn't have helped the cause of the majority uh -huh. so what did i say so i said the court could have made an order that go find the so give the order straight away even without an application that's what i said so i said between friday and saturday go find speaker if he doesn't respond either the court will sit saturday evening or the court could have made an order that uh, Saturday after 8 p.m. If you, that, you don't get him, then blast it in the mass media. Mr. That's Pebu, what I was saying. The court can make those orders. Mr. Pebu, you respectfully are not listening to me. So, I will no, make so, the point that what, 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 what exactly about the is No, it's no, not no, about no, order 7. Listen, no, no, hold on, hold on. Okay, okay. So, so what, what is your issue? What's your point? Really? Service has already been done. No, no, no. What no, was before the court? No, I said, wait, wait. wait. What was before oh, no. the court okay. is the ex party application. Yes. I said, yes. did yes. anybody yes. try yes. to yes. send yes. the speaker yes. with the yes. ex party application? No, no, no. 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 So, so ah. the reason why the service does not even come in is that. Oh. Has a service been done in this particular expert motion? This expert motion. No, no, hold on. I just want to. What I've said is all true. Gentlemen, hold on. Hold on. Listen, listen to mm. me, off, Alfred. Substituted service does not even come in because, hey. in our estimation, service has already been done because of the service. Did they serve on the application? Well, hold on. Hey. So, please listen hold to hold me. On. Can can you listen hold to me? I'm saying that service of what? The person prostrate service of what? Wait, wait. As wait. near as possible to him. The speaker of parliament, in his ruling, indicated, and and. I found a market on the floor of parliament. Said that no, no, yeah, the process no, was thrown at the legal department. Please, you do hear that or you do not hear that. No, no, yeah, is that not service? No, if it is thrown at the person, that is service. So, if it starts to use that service, that's not even coming here. But okay. I am pointing to you that the conduct of the Speaker of Parliament and the legal department allowed us to protect the sanctity of parliament, to protect the sanctity, and if you like, the representation of the four constituencies by going as part to the Supreme Court to make sure that we stay execution so that the status quo ante will be no, restored but, for us. And so okay. it is not it is not wrong. Okay, for us so, to have gone as part of the motion. Uh, for the, the question is you talk about service being done. In that particular instance that you reference what Afenyo Makin himself resisted vehemently when the speaker said he threw it, he said he did not do that. And that is a matter of his integrity. If you were not in Parliament, maybe you missed that point. Please, but I did not miss that. But I'm saying that the okay, Speaker of Parliament no, no, himself but, but, was not at the legal department. Okay, but if you say... It is an account if you say, of if what you he say, has been told. And I think Mark made it clear to him that but, he may have been told things that are not right. So, But he refused and refuted the fact that he did not go in there to throw it. And you are saying that this morning, that throwing a, serve, the, a suit... Or this particular it was left it was, it was it, left it amounts to service in that as form possible as near as possible as near as possible that is the where, dictate where, of CF on seven, on the seven. and and as near as possible where exactly did he serve the speaker at the legal department at the legal department and did the legal department because the speaker of parliament the, himself no, have said that he, you, you no, cannot no. serve him personally but take it to the legal department good did the legal department receive that particular service that is why i'm saying that there has been frustration on the no, part no, no. of the legal department. So was there was, was there service or not? Because you said yes, because by your estimation, as service as has been done. Yes, no. it was left as You are saying that the legal department did not receive the service. And now you're saying, saying service has been done. So how do I reconcile the two? Yes, because the law says that if the person refuses service, leave it as near as possible to the person. And, and did, that is service. Did they leave it at the legal department? I'm suggesting to you that that was that. Uh, okay, so no. what, and and, 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 and what, what was it? And I just want to make a point. And because the speaker was clear in his ruling that he had directed the legal department not to accept any service until he Which is, is consulted. Wait, wait, until he is consulted. But how, the law how, the how, of how, how? So the I'm speaker coming. of parliament so does not he, have the law in his bosom to decide but when he, is, he, is, he, 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 he is the leader of parliament so 
You, so you should trample upon the Constitution? Mr. Kaisi, let's come in briefly. Yeah. Listen, Is that what I, you're saying? I, I, as if we are. Are you aware yeah. that what uh, Avenue Markin sought to serve the first time is different from what was uh, uh, filed yesterday? This one that the Supreme Court sat on yesterday, it was filed the same yesterday. It was filed the same yesterday, probably even uh, afternoon. It wasn't 9 a.m., not 10 a.m. Yes, what they dealt with yesterday was filed yesterday, and within hours, the Supreme Court sat. So my point is that that is the one, because it's different in nature from the first one they sought to serve, the court should have given an opportunity. Ah, what was dealt with yesterday was filed yesterday. That is what I'm telling you. Beyond 10 o'clock, it was probably in the afternoon mm -hmm. from the uh, estimation, and we can get the exact time, but it wasn't 9 a.m., it wasn't 10 a.m. Okay. It wasn't 9 a.m. It wasn't 10 a.m. It was filed the same yesterday. Who yeah. attempted to Mr. serve Martin that on the speaker? Mr. Martin, yes. my lecture okay. that I am so much pleased. Yes. I'm saying that uh -huh. yesterday was a Friday. Yes. And so the Speaker of Parliament has already indicated that oh. if it is not Monday, I'm not taking any service. Oh, please, 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 please. I why do you don't do that? Okay. Okay. As if you haven't no. practiced if, much, if, that's if, why you're if doing If I am your client, no, no, Mr. No, no, Martin, no, no, will you advise me? Don't do that. There you is a Parliament of the who has already said that I won't receive service on Friday. Let's you still go and serve me. You, you have can use other means to block okay. the Look, ruling. Let me tell you, the way no. it goes is that once no. what was attempted to be said, mm -hmm. that ap earlier application, we're looking for an injunction okay. earlier on, right? And then they couldn't serve, they couldn't get the court, etc. It's different from the application that was filed yesterday. Probably close to noon, mm -hmm. and this then within the, this, hours. This ex parte motion. Yes, this ex parte one is different from the first one. Okay. So the first one, what we do is that you apply. There's a mother case. Let me call it a mother. A mother gives birth, right? So there is a case that you've taken to the Supreme Court. Then on the back of it, you mount an application, either for injunction or whatever. So there are two. So that's why they try to serve first. And from what the speaker is even saying, it means that he says the Chief Justice agreed. He says he's giving a directive, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. You, for now, let's leave that for Mr. Speaker and, and, and Chief Martin, Justice. And, and Mr. No, Martin, no, no. my so, lecture so. that I'm well pleased, you think that the Speaker of Parliament can do so, and you serve the powers, so if you like, you serve provisions in the Constitution and provisions in the subsidiary legislation? Ah, what I say, if it's agreed under practice directions, you think everything that is and in the practice, practice directions... Direction according to so, Article so. 11... Please, ah, please, oh, please. Imagine, that's not the occasion for this. Please, no, please, so, 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 so if the chief justice agreed, you as if what you know what went into rate. If you know what went into rate, so gentlemen, if the chief justice agreed, do you know what went into rate? That's why I said we'll leave that. Otherwise, we will skate matters. Thank you. Thank you. Now, Mr. Martin, the justices are not bigger than the provisions in our constitution. It doesn't matter what they was agreed in the conclave. The constitution is supreme. Article one tells you the constitution. So you don't know that if you agree something with somebody and you want to change. Ketsu at least would demand that you put him on notice that I'm no longer going by this agreement. What are you saying? What are you saying? What are you saying? Are you saying? Okay. Ah, so, so you can agree something with somebody, then you go behind the person and do something different. I, I, I hear that. I, I hear. I hear. Lawyer, lawyer Sefua, lawyer Sefua, I hear you continuously. Lawyer Sefua, I hear you continuously refer to this conclave that was agreed per the speaker's declaration as an alleged conclave. Are you saying that you know that this conclave or this agreement may not have been had between the Speaker and the Chief Justice on the period of so. service? I am only saying that that conclave cannot surmount the provisions of the Constitution. Please, that is what I'm saying. And Lawyer Martin, people cannot deny knowledge of this. But it's How about the procedure. So if you agree with somebody and then later you think what that thing is wrong, you just go ahead, no. rough shot. Okay. Won't you put the person on notice that look, listen, I'm resiling from it. So that's why I said the court could have given another opportunity. So they would then in the have already indicated hey. to you that when you come by way of notice, hmm. I am not taking your service because it is not a mandate. This well, is what 